If you're trying to clean up your Death Knight play and mop, there's a tool that makes it way easier to see what's actually going on in your fights. It's called the Warcraft Logs Analyzer, and it pulls all your buffs, uptime, cooldowns, and ability usage into one place, so you can see what you're doing well and where you slipped up. This is thanks to Waves, who's been keeping this thing alive. Ducks originally made it back in Wrath, and now Waves has brought it from Kata into Mop 2. The best part for us is that Frost DKs are finally supporting it. The only thing to keep in mind is that if you're running Runic Empowerment, the Analyzer can't track rune states properly since those procs don't show up buff in the logs. That's the same problem it had back in Kata, but if you're using Blood Tap or Runic Corruption, everything works exactly the way it should. Waves is trying to figure out a fix for this in the future, so stay tuned. Using it is simple. Just download the browser extension, I'll put the link in the description, then go to warcraftlogs.com and pull up a fight you want to check out. For this example, I'll use a Protector of the Endless kill. Go into Damage Done, click on your character, and you'll see a red button pop up that says Analyze. Click that and it'll load all the details for the fight. Now you can see things like how many cooldowns you actually used, whether you were lining them up properly, and how you handled your killing machine procs with Frost Strike. Right now the tool is built to check the Master Frost rotation, but maybe in the future it'll be able to spot Obliterate builds as well. It will also look at your pets, so you can see how your ghoul and army lined up with your cooldowns, and how much damage they added. If you switch over to the timeline view, it gets even more detailed, showing every cast you pressed, what buffs were active, and what your rune state looked at the exact moment. This is where you can start spotting patterns. You'll see how much time you are taking between abilities, and since the DK GCD is 1 second, you can figure out exactly how much extra delay you had. It shows which runes came from Blood Tap or Plague Leech, and more importantly, whether you are wasting resources by sitting capped on runes or runic power. Like here, I used Howling Blast with a Rhyme proc, so it didn't cost any runes. And here, I went for Frost Strike while still full on runes, but that was fine since I had a Killing Machine proc. These are the kinds of small choices you want to look at, because over the course of a fight, they really add up. So if your DPS feels lower than it should, this is a great way to figure out why. Grab the extension, throw it on your logs, and go through your fights. You'll catch mistakes you probably didn't even know you were making. 